and welcome back to the channel on this video I wanted to talk again about something I've talked about before and I've had a few complaints uh, not that they're there but that they are not clear and that's bike lanes we don't have bike lanes everywhere but we do have some so uh, I can't complain there because there are folks that don't have any bike lanes where they live and so to have some at least in some areas is better than having none at all but the one thing I don't like about the bike lanes is how they get things in the bike lanes and I don't mean debris that's I don't think you're going to stop that unless you get a, a street sweeper that come out every single hour of the day and even then there's no guarantees that it's gonna stay clear it just takes five minutes and there's just crap in the uh, bike lane but uh, it's the trash cans and uh, recycle uh, bins and uh, yard debris bins and vehicles that park uh, in the bike lanes that's where we have the problem and so I was doing a little looking up and Apparently, at least in the state of Oregon, you're not supposed to be putting those things in the bike lane. I did see somewhere though, I couldn't get a 100% absolute definitive uh, on this, but uh, it looks like it's uh, prohibited, except for, I did read one article where it said something about a two hour leeway before trash pickup and after trash pickup, but you know, Trash pickup doesn't have a specific exact time, right? As to when they pick it up, it's like your mail delivery. It doesn't come at a, a precise, up to the minute, you know, every day. It could vary, right? And so, um, but anyway, that's what they're saying. A two hour leeway, I did read somewhere where they can have it out there up to two hours, but um, before and after pickup. But, uh, like for example recently when I was out riding and there was trash cans in the bike lane it was at three o'clock in the afternoon and I know most places anyway trash gets picked up in the morning sometime in the morning it could be um, early morning like 6 a.m. like at where I'm at it's usually like 6 in the morning that they're picking up the trash and so, so, go there. so uh, at three o'clock in the afternoon, I don't think the trash would still be there and not picked up. I mean, I could be wrong, but that's well after, at least if I compare it to my place anyway, where it gets picked up early in the morning. And as far as cars in the bike lane, cars are not supposed to be in the bike lane. The only time they can be in the bike lane is to turn in if they're turning right or left into a driveway or into onto another road. They, you know, they're or if their car is uh, if their car is broke down or. You ran out of gas, I mean, you have no choice, right? You got to get off the road. But I mean, can you imagine? This might sound silly, but it's kind of the way bikers, we could look at it is, what if they put the car or the uh, trash cans and recycle bins in the uh, road? You know, right out on the road here. Uh, it's the same thing. That's the way we see it as bikers. It's in our road. We don't have as wide a road as a car. And you can simply just say, oh yeah, I just go around it. But there's times when you could be coming around a corner and not see that, or it could be uh, uh, dark outside. And you know, the bikes, let's face it, a lot of bikes don't have the greatest headlight in the world. 
and yeah you could put a better headlight on there and all that but the easier simpler solution would be to not have the trash can in there to begin with or a vehicle parked in there and I've seen several cars parked in the uh, in the um, bike lane before and I've seen trash cans this road's a bit different we just saw trash cans right there but this is, there's no bike lane there this is a residential street a little bit different there's no bike lane here so that, that's different and some people are going to say well where do we put the trash cans and well that's not my decision to make I just know that they're not supposed to be in the bike lane I think it probably is better to have them actually up on the sidewalk although that's not really good either but um, because I think riding the bike you're going faster than you are walking so pedestrians could walk around it or they could yeah walk around it or I don't know kick it out of the way out. but anyway um, bikes though we only have a sh short enough or uh, narrow enough uh, bike lane especially in some areas it's like two feet and um, there's no room other than going out onto the road and sometimes it's a busy road anyway uh, yeah I, I did not know until I looked this up that it's actually prohibitive to have trash cans in the bike lane. so I thought I would do a video and share that with you it'll depend maybe on your state I'm speaking about the state of Oregon I should clarify that I think I did see something in California too about not, not allowing it It could also go right down to regions where you're at. riding along right now on the ride one up cafe cruiser and we're just cruising along here in pedal assist 3 bouncing between 22 and 23 miles per hour into the wind so if you know anything about the laws in your area with regard to trash cans or cars parked in the bike lane maybe leave that in the comments uh, section and share with us as far as what the legalities are in your area and that would help some people that might live in your area too to know and you can actually report issues like that I haven't done that I, I won't do that but um, I'm going to get off the road here for a second. Alright. Well, that's going to do it for this video. I thought I would just share that information with regard to the bike lane. There it goes. I was trying to power off my bike and wasn't wanting to power off. So if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you want to be, uh, or if you'd like to subscribe to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And thank you very much for supporting us. If you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. And if you want to comment on this video or any other video, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. 
and once again thank you for joining me on this video and until next time keep your wheels on the road see you later